Welcome back to DC Today. We're continuing our chat with Derek McGinty, and we're talking about the passing of Herman Cain. You know, we were just talking about this tweet that he had put out around June 20th, and we're seeing it now on the screen, and it read, masks will not be mandatory for the event, which will be attended by President Trump. People are fed up. Talk about that tweet and what he was referring to. That he was referring to, of course, the Tulsa rally in Oklahoma that was, first of all, under-attended. It only had 6,000 people, and they expected at least 20. And nobody there, or few there, were wearing masks, including our president and his entourage, who all showed up as well. And then, of course, there was a little bit of a spike, they, they believe, in cases after folks left the, the, uh, the gathering there because nobody was socially distancing or following any of the protocols that we've now, many of us have come to think are not optional when mm -hmm. it comes to this disease. Absolutely. A lot of times he seems like he goes it alone, but there's so many people following his direction yeah. right now. And unfortunately, Herman Cain was one of those. Yes, exactly. We're going to leave it right there, Derek. Thank you so much for coming on and dissecting everything and giving us your insight. That's why we have you on, and that's why we're going to have you back. Thanks oh, again. Thank you so much, Antoinette. Good to be here. Stay safe, my friend. Everybody, stay with us. More of DC Today when we come back.